Tesla is about to make a significant breakthrough with the Model Y 2025, and the changes promise to shake up the market. CEO Elon Musk and his team are gearing up for a revolution in both pricing strategy and production for this highly anticipated model. The expectation is that the Model Y 2025, possibly called the Model Y Juniper, will bring new deals and insane discounts. But are these offers just a ploy to clear out inventory before the new models arrive? Let's explore all the nuances of this innovative strategy together. Over the past year, Tesla has slashed prices on various models to boost sales. Recently, however, the company shifted tactics, increasing the prices of the Model S and Model X by $2,000. This volatility in pricing is nothing new for Tesla, which has raised and lowered the price of the Model Y multiple times this year. Sudden increases might seem confusing, but they reflect the need to adjust prices to balance production and demand. One of the most promising changes for the future of the Model Y Juniper is the drop in battery prices, which cannot be underestimated. According to recent research, battery costs are projected to decrease by about 40% between 2022 and 2026. This significant reduction in the cost of one of the most expensive components of electric vehicles can completely transform the automotive industry landscape. Just imagine, this saving could translate to a reduction of up to $5,000 in the final price of the car for consumers. It's an advancement that makes electric vehicles more accessible and attractive to a broader audience. This reduction in battery prices not only benefits consumers, but also strengthens Tesla's competitive position in the market. With lower production costs, the company can offer more competitive prices without sacrificing its profit margins. This is essential in a market where competition is rapidly intensifying, with new players entering the electric vehicle arena almost daily. Personally, I think this strategy puts Tesla in an enviable position, allowing it to continue leading innovation while maintaining affordable prices. On the other hand, we must consider the impact of the forecasted inflation for 2025. Although it's not an exorbitant rate, inflation can offset some of the savings achieved with the reduction in battery costs. This means that despite the drop in battery prices, the base price of the Model Y Juniper might still see an increase. However, I believe Tesla is well prepared to mitigate these effects. With its ability to quickly adjust prices and its ever-increasing production efficiency, the company can manage these cost increases effectively. Furthermore, Tesla has a history of facing economic challenges and coming out on top. The company has already demonstrated its ability to adapt in various situations, whether adjusting its pricing strategy or innovating in its production processes. Therefore, even with the forecasted inflation, I am confident that Tesla will find ways to keep the Model Y Juniper competitive in terms of price. It is this resilience and capacity for innovation that makes Tesla a leader in the electric vehicle sector. Another crucial point is eligibility for the Federal Electric Vehicle Tax Credit. To qualify, the Model Y Juniper will need to meet three main requirements, price cap, buyer income limit, and final assembly in North America. Tesla, with its vertical integration strategy and domestic production, is well positioned to meet these criteria. This could mean additional savings for buyers, especially with additional state incentives. The production efficiency at the Shanghai Gigafactory is truly impressive. The factory is running at full capacity, producing a Model Y every 30 seconds, thanks to a 95% level of automation. This degree of automation is one of the factors that allows Tesla to maintain quality and consistency in mass production, something essential for a company aiming to meet growing global demand. Additionally, this efficiency is fundamental for Tesla to achieve its ambitious goal of manufacturing 3 million cars annually. By reducing cycle times and optimizing every step of the manufacturing process, Tesla not only increases its production capacity but also reduces costs and minimizes waste. Fast and efficient production helps Tesla maintain its leadership in the electric vehicle market. 
In a sector where innovation and the ability to respond to market changes are crucial, Tesla's ability to produce high-quality vehicles in large volumes is a significant advantage. This not only ensures that the company can meet growing global demand, but also that it can do so sustainably and profitably. Personally, I believe this combination of efficiency and innovation is what continues to put Tesla ahead of its competitors. It's a testament to the company's commitment to excellence and its ability to quickly adapt to market needs. Tesla is also expanding its international operations, which is a brilliant strategic move. Negotiations to open a new gigafactory in Thailand are underway, representing an incredible opportunity for the company. Thailand, with its robust automotive manufacturing sector, offers an ideal environment for this expansion. The existing infrastructure, combined with local manufacturing talent, can help Tesla quickly establish an efficient and productive operation. Moreover, Tesla's presence in the country can encourage other automakers to consider Thailand as a manufacturing hub, further boosting the local economy. It's a win-win situation. Tesla expands its production capacity and Thailand strengthens its automotive sector. Expansions like this are crucial for Tesla's growth strategy. By diversifying its production locations, the company can reduce risks associated with regional disruptions and better serve different global markets. The expansion into Thailand also demonstrates Tesla's long-term vision, seeking opportunities in regions with growth potential. Personally, I see this strategy as a smart way to ensure that Tesla not only maintains its leadership position, but also continues to innovate and expand into new markets. It's a move that will undoubtedly strengthen Tesla's global presence and its ability to meet the growing demand for electric vehicles. The Shanghai Gigafactory and the potential new factory in Thailand are clear examples of how Tesla is shaping the future of automotive manufacturing. The combination of high automation, production efficiency, and strategic expansion uniquely positions the company in the market. This multifaceted approach not only ensures that Tesla can produce vehicles on a large scale, but also that it can do so with a level of quality and innovation that few can match. For me, it's exciting to see how Tesla is continually pushing the boundaries of what's possible in electric vehicle manufacturing. Efficiency and expansion are just parts of a broader strategy by Tesla to dominate the electric vehicle market. With each new factory and technological advance, the company is building a solid foundation for the future. The ability to quickly produce high-quality vehicles in various parts of the world will allow Tesla to meet global demand more effectively and sustainably. And this capacity for adaptation and continuous innovation is what keeps the company at the forefront of the industry. The production strategy for the model, Y 2025 reflects a significant shift in how Tesla plans to maintain its market dominance. With the Shanghai Gigafactory operating at full capacity, Tesla is focused on meeting its delivery goals by the end of the year. The factory, known for its high level of automation, integrates four workshops into a compact space, optimizing the production flow and reducing costs. The impact of these changes on the production and pricing of the Model Y 2025 will be significant. The new model is expected to maintain its current price despite numerous updates to the exterior, interior, and features. This would be the best case scenario, but many factors, such as inflation and battery costs, will influence the final price. Even with these challenges, Tesla is confident that it can offer a competitive and affordable vehicle. Elon Musk's recent visit to Beijing, where he met with high officials including Premier Li Keqiang, underscores the importance of China to Tesla. The meeting likely discussed the deployment of Tesla's full self-driving software and data transfer permissions, but it may have also been an attempt to accelerate the production of the Model Y Juniper. China is a crucial market for Tesla, and ensuring efficient production in the country is a priority. Building a new battery plant in Nevada is a strategically crucial move for Tesla. This facility will be equipped with cutting-edge technology provided by the Chinese giant CATL, marking a significant technological advance. 
However, in a smart move to avoid criticism about Chinese influence in U.S. manufacturing, CATL will not be directly involved in production. This allows Tesla to leverage CATL's advanced technology without compromising its independence and public perception. Additionally, this approach helps Tesla maintain eligibility for important tax credits, which are vital for keeping prices competitive and attracting more consumers. The decision to build this plant in Nevada is not just about production and technology. It is also a strategic response to new regulations that restrict the use of components from certain countries for tax incentive qualification. By ensuring that production and materials comply with these regulations, Tesla is proactively positioning itself to maximize available tax benefits. This is crucial in a market where every competitive edge counts. Personally, I find Tesla's approach not only strategic, but also visionary. Furthermore, adapting to new regulations is an aspect that many companies underestimate, but Tesla has shown mastery in this area. With regulations constantly changing, especially in critical markets like the US, the ability to adapt quickly is a significant competitive advantage. The Nevada plant is a perfect example of how Tesla is preparing for these changes, ensuring that its products not only meet but exceed regulatory standards. Another interesting point is how the construction of this plant reinforces Tesla's strategic independence. By keeping control over battery production within the U.S., the company reduces its dependence on foreign suppliers and potential supply chain disruptions. This is particularly important at a time when geopolitical tensions could drastically impact international trade. In my view, this independence is key to Tesla's long-term resilience. They are building a robust and diversified supply chain that can withstand the pressures of a volatile global market. By investing in domestic infrastructure, the company is creating jobs and boosting the local economy while reducing the carbon footprint associated with transporting components. This sustainable approach is one of the reasons Tesla continues to be a respected and admired global brand. Personally, I believe that this combination of innovation, regulatory adaptation, and sustainability is what sets Tesla apart from other automakers. Finally, it's important to note that this strategy is not just about batteries or tax credits. It's about Tesla's long-term vision to transform the automotive industry in the way we think about sustainable mobility. Each new plant, each new technology, and each regulatory compliance is a step toward a future where electric vehicles are the norm, not the exception. The potential of the Model Y Juniper is enormous especially if Tesla can maintain an affordable price while introducing new technologies and improvements. The reduction in battery costs, combined with production efficiency, will allow Tesla to offer a high-quality vehicle at a competitive price. Consumers will have the opportunity to enjoy a car with cutting-edge technology, improved design, and superior performance without paying exorbitant prices. Expanding into new markets, like Thailand, is a smart move by Tesla. With the growing global demand for electric vehicles, expanding production to new countries helps meet this demand and reduce logistical costs. Moreover, Tesla's presence in new markets may encourage other companies to follow suit, promoting the growth of the global electric vehicle sector. The Model Y 2025 is a perfect example of how Tesla is redefining the future of electric vehicles. With a combination of competitive pricing, production efficiency, and advanced technologies, the new model promises to be a hit with consumers. Tesla is demonstrating to the world that it is possible to offer high-quality electric vehicles at affordable prices, changing the perception that these vehicles are only for the wealthy.